Well, here it is. Uh, I've been wanting to build this uh, for a week. Uh, the uh, plastic front bumper on my 522XI was, you know, I think I cracked it up last year or the year before. And I, it finally broke uh, my last mowing about a week ago. And I have this uh, one and a half inch by one and a half inch perforated steel I've had sitting around my storage and I just wanted to make this bumper so here she is uh, bolted together um, eventually I'm going to bring the tractor into a shop and have that welded you know that'll take all of a few minutes I have that welded once it's welded I'll take the bolts out Available on one and a half inch. This is one and a half inch outside diameter. Then there's one and a quarter inch. Then there's one inch. The one and a quarter inch fits and slides inside of this one, and the one inch slides inside the one and a quarter. So once it's uh, once this is welded right, you know, right there and right there, I'll take the bolts out. So basically have a front attachment uh, apparatus here I get battery out uh, the grill will fit on uh, but uh, you know it's not pretty but now I got a bumper on the front I think yeah my tractors a little bit over 40 inches wide let me get out the tape measure here you know, front tire they got at the rear without uh, the wheel spacers on it's about 40.5 inches wide so let's uh, let's do rough measure four and a quarter sorry this is a very another one of my very amateur videos for six and plus 29 okay about 39 inches wide outside front tire to outside front tire those are 16 by 6.58 front tires uh, stock front turf tires on the 5xi track trackers are 16 by 7.58 and if you plan on putting any uh, 16 by 6.5 front tires on your 5xi tractor put tubes in them otherwise the tires won't stay on the rims but uh there she is here's the bumper that came off the tractor um, I wish someone would make uh, fiberglass replacement front bumpers for these because they're so easy to break. When I see them on eBay, they sell pretty fast. So, okay. Well, I uh, I should go home and uh, take a nap. I only slept uh, two hours last night. Oh, I got. Oh no, I got um, dragonflies. I got dragonflies flying around here. Oh, look at it. Come on, come here. I just love dragonflies. Come here, buddy. Okay, let me turn that off. There you go. I just love dragonflies. My favorite insect. Happens one, about once a year. And there's two of these have been flying around for the last ten minutes. And I just love these insects. They are so cool. With a 
simply safe system. Fire, There's uh, you name it. And that's the wasp enough. try to get a um, catch the bad guys try to build a action. nest in the they sliding door here. And that's where the foam is simply in there. That door system. there. Protect it. Door, Look at that. Oh, that is window, so cool. That's got to be that you want protected in your home a three, all of those sensors, three and a half inch wingspan. I just love the dragon bikes. They are so cool. Via wi -Fi to the monitoring service. The That's monitoring a wasp service just buzzed my trigger. wrist. They can look in after such a trigger. That is such a cool insect. I just love these things. There's no long-term contract for this service, by the way. How are you there doing there? And there's no fine print. Monitoring is $15 yeah. a month. Month to month. Cancel well, this is my special moment this, this no summer. Earlier today, I chased the um, Union Pacific 4014 Big Boy steam engine from uh, south of Stillwater to uh, Baldwin, Wisconsin. They stopped in Baldwin for about 45 minutes. There was a big crowd of people. You can see that on one of my other videos. But Oh, this is so cool. I wish I had my other hand free so I could touch the wings of this thing. Okay, there you go. Uh, dragonflies. They chase mosquitoes and stuff. Democrats are turned off. A couple years ago, when I got one of these to land on my hand, um, hope you don't mind hearing Rush Limbaugh in the background. A couple years ago, when one of these landed on my hand for a few minutes, it flew off and I chased it on the front lawn in front of the house I live in. And I got close to it. Borders and, free and it landed on my hair and buzzed its and wings and flew away. I just love these things. Which will be just such a neat insect. Looks like its eyes are clear. Or is that its eyes inside? Yeah. Six legs. Okay, okay, that's its head. It turned its head. I hope this turns. Okay, the screen, my screen, I can't see much of my screen now. I guess prehistoric dragonflies were much bigger than this. At Stiefel, we believe investment advice is about more than helping you manage I remember your years ago Our driving down the road it's about providing your kids with the windows with open in my car in in your and, realizing your and a storm was coming and a dragonfly flew into my car, landed on my arm. Was either, no, I think it was landed on my left hand there. And it, it, I mean, it stuck with me for several miles. And I had to use my hand to steer the car because it was a manual transmission. I finally, I shook my hand several times and it finally flew off. This has got to be a record for the longest time I've had a dragonfly land on or stay on my hand. This is yeah. Are you out hunting mosquitoes? Wait, the sun is shining. You're not going to be hunting mosquitoes. Hmm. Hi, John Wisco here. As so the owner of Advantage Auto Glass, I'd like to invite you to finally get that chipped or cracked windshield fixed right. So intriguing. Four wings instead of two. And a tail. Look at that blue. Blue along the middle, green in the back. Okay, there he flies off. 
Oh, he chased after. He chased after a wasp. Okay, he's flying around. Yeah. Aren't you an interesting insect? Let me turn off the radio. Yeah, aren't you cool? stops and he hovers and he flies around oh, and he lands back on a weed there he goes oh man that is so cool yeah it just hovers right there like a helicopter just amazing Ah, okay. Is he looking for a place to... Oh, man. I should look up video. I know I've watched some videos on YouTube of dragonflies. And this is so cool. This is so cool. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yesterday I had a delivery down to the river and there were thousands of mayflies flying all over. They were all over on the sides of the boats on the sides of buildings. Mm. Oh, this is cool. It's feeling a little bit warmer today. It is um, Tuesday, July 23rd, 2019. Oh. I didn't know my video was going to have minutes and minutes and minutes of uh, dragonflies. There was a second one flying around. I haven't seen it for several minutes. For some reason, this one's intrigued with my fan. Okay. Mm, he flies up there. And he lands. And he flies off again. Oh, wow. I remember years ago seeing a dragonfly perched on a branch and it was and it had and it had a mosquito in its in its front paws it was eating a mosquito i hate mosquitoes i hate mosquitoes with a passion oh wow oh i can feel that sun i just had a wasp buzz the back of my hair well it's warm here i think i've gotten a, the longest video I can imagine of a dragonfly that thing must have been on my hand for five minutes okay the darn wasp I think the darn wasps are getting in this door from the raised ribs uh, op opening of the raised ribs on the tops my dad and his wife came here uh, it was two or three years ago I think it was three years ago to see my pedal cart project that I had right here and some wasp flew out of that hole there and stung my dad uh, he, he, he was fine but it wasn't fun getting stung 
I was upset that that happened. Mm. Oh, wow. This is so cool. Mm. Anyway. All right. Well, I've got a really long video of a dragonfly, and it's feeling warm here. So thanks for watching. See ya.